And the cab to charge him as well. Result as well. Apparently, some of their men came. What? How the fuck did they get over there? I mean, that's their king, yes, yeah, so we're gonna be fine. We're gonna kill him as well. Guys are out of ammunition. How about you fucking run? You chase these down. This is more or less a done deal. Once you actually develop them like this. Why ain't you shooting? Can they shoot at that? I have the can, let's just move them. You actually want to hunt some of these down. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Don't shoot that. Oh, my God. They're shooting our own guys in the back. Italian swordsmen! Ready and waiting! Spearmen, at the ready! On double time! Fire your command! You guys make it out, yes they did. Unfortunately. And that way ain't gonna save you. I mean, you see an enemy like uh, in a fort, it's gonna be easy to beat them because you can burn all the walls down, flank them in all the different ways. Actually, get our king outside as well, or our general went to St Strabo. Look, 
Lucky Hound down the, the ones that flee. Try and get these out guys out of there. We lost a lot. Orders understood. As you come on. The men are wavering. No, 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 no. Why can't they run that way? So we don't face him in battle again. Fortunately, that's going to be a freaking issue here. Fucking tower is gonna kill our general generals. Of course. Yeah, there they go. Mass route. as many of them as we can. Anyway, you don't fire. We're gonna kill more of ours than theirs. Look at how many of them are there. <laughs> if I lose my general to fucking tower fire, that's gonna be fucking amazing. when you press space you can see the enemies clearly on the battlefield like you did in medieval 2 that's all of them yeah they only 200 of them left we only lost 600 although we did lose a lot of brink pays Look at that, a thousand kills on the swordsman. Yeah, that's something. Can you slay all of them? 
No, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to take it next turn. Their garrison should be shit, since they did conquer it like a couple of days ago. Two turns ago. Ready for orders. Let's see. Melee skill for all heavy infantry. Yeah, that's for sure. Hmm. Yeah, when this is it was yeah, it was a sure win because the AI is dumb, but it was a a decent battle. Melee attack skill for sure. Let's see what the garrison's like here. Uh, pretty shit. Ready for orders. Besieging settlements. Gonna be an easy, easy alt resolve. Now, since we did take them out, it might be a good idea. Do these guys actually have another settlement? I did just. Oh, shit. Good and noble friend. What an honor are you. Might be a good idea to leave two armies here so we can knock him out. Might. Ready for battle. At ease, men. Get them there. Lower the upkeep. Yeah, look at that. Minus 10 morale for all enemy units. That's so good. How much time is it going to take? Six turns. Okay, sure, we can go for that. Okay, now. Let's check if there's another army here. Look at that, that's what I mean. They just leave this open. Although there couldn't be massing armies here to just, you know, naval invade us. Got the fleet here. Let's recruit a couple more here. I'm not sure how good these are or are not. So we'll see once we go into a fight with them. It should be easy enough to secure this. Yeah, and they are gonna replenish in three turns. Not bad. Could be worse. How moving unseen. Else is fine. Hmm. Yeah, that should fix up the food problem. And culture is going up here. Yeah, but anyways, guys, it's midnight, so I'm gonna end this one here. So next time we're gonna take this, and hopefully we're gonna take the fight to Carthage as well. Now it might be easier to take out Carthage itself than uh, what's it called Corsica in Sardinia. been taking Syracuse first, of course, but uh, then taking Corsica and S uh, Sardinia. We'll see. I do, I do, I do want to see how these guys fare in a battle. So I'm not sure. We still don't have the military wharfs, but we should have them in six turns. Plus another like six turns before that completes, uh, the construction completes on that, which is going to take a while. You come here. Maybe we do need to wait a couple of turns before before we can cancel the trade agreement with it. Do have a lot of cav here. I 
We have the finances to build another army. We'll see what happens. All right. Let's continue where we left off. I need to take out the variants up north, secure that border, and move on to Carthage. Hopefully they're not going to strike while I'm dealing with the barbarians up there. But they might. Do have a spy looking out for their armies. some images man okay let's see yeah they only have well they have a full stack and the b2 we just took that have another army here Should be able. Mm. The next turn is gonna be winter, so we ain't gonna be able to jump at them yet. We're recruiting a navy here. And Carthage so far is not doing any. Well, they could just appear out of the fucking fog here and attack Rome itself. That's not gonna be great. I'm surprised their client state didn't actually. At least I think they're it's their their client state. Military ally didn't join them. Ever in service to Check everything here real quick. What's the culture like here? We still need a real, little bit more romanization there. Okay, let's in turn, see what they do. Actually, right. I did. Ha I do have a trade agreement with them. Welcome. We will talk and then we will feast until our guts rumble and our backsides ache from overuse. Okay, then we have time to actually prepare to an attack on them. At your command, Commander. I start recruiting another army to go down south. Just check the populations a little bit. Mm, look at that. He's pretty decent. Oh, plus two empire maintenance is not good. I might actually recruit an army to just garrison this area here once we take it. That might be a better idea. Because we're probably going to get declared war on by these up here. Except for Salia. And even the Etruscans might actually want their land back who knows and they got at least not, they got two full stacks almost to take on Taurus and the garrisons are not that good in this uh, mod even though people say they are you literally have shit stacks in your garrisons
A river of goods and coin between our lands would surely see all prosper. Okay, sure, better to get trade agreements than war. It focuses on Carthage. Oh, nice. Ready for battle. March until your feet bleed. Then march some more. Okay, since it's unavoidable, unavoidable, let's just sit there, wait for it to happen. We're gonna need that here. now okay 13 versus 13 let's see how they fare because I have no freaking clue you sure they're gonna get help from the settlement there what about without them I think I'm gonna just auto resolve these because uh, I'm not that good at uh, navy or uh, naval battles. The waves still beckon. Yeah, I think we're gonna need the military wharfs. You know, right, we have, we're researching them. We're gonna get them. We need them to attack. I'm probably gonna build them there. I'm gonna need them to attack Carthage, but. Wait a minute. Who are you? Yes. Yeah, let's keep him an admiral. We're gonna need one admiral. That's our family. Here, missile attack, movement speed. Any place? How does this work for a fucking general then game? Look at that, plus 11 tax rate. Ooh, we need to place that to someone else. Let's, pretend, let's go with the authority. Okay, you. Where's the thing? There you go. Ready for battle. On the move. Get moving, you wretches! Ready for orders. Let's move them like here. Haste, I don't know where the rebellion is gonna spawn in. Carth is not making a move yet. Let's recruit a general here. Public order, construction costs. Let's go with the public order one. You just sit there. That's your command. Well, from mines, we're not going to have any other things, so for a long time. It's discovering public order. Let's go with public order. Plus, we're gonna be able to like get through the trade agreement with them next turn. Question is, is that the navy or a fleet, army fleet?
We are a mighty people, well versed in the uses of wealth and nah. I can't think of any game, Total War game in the past, I don't know how long. A decade or two that has good diplomacy in it, or for a reason for alliances. Except, I guess, Total War Warhammer, if you're a empire faction, you need to befriend the dwarves because you can't take the territory. I mean, you can't take the territory, but rather them have it. Why would we care? Lost one of them, and I think a couple of these. Ready, willing, and of course, we can't reach him in one turn. Why would we? At your command. How can I be of assistance? I just steal food there for now. Okay, that's an actual army. Families. Go with the Papira one. Okay, so you. Supply train first, and a couple of cab units. Hmm, no, I guess hoplites though. Let's go get a couple of triarii. The guards will have me listen to you, but do not pass the day in words without merit. Saved the name. I welcome you, worthy speaker. I listen because your people are known to have honor. Okay, eighteen hundred is not no go. My friend, a merchant. We do not want your gold. I accept the name of our people. Let what about you guys? Did you warm up? Nope. Let's see here. Good and noble friend. What a... Can we declare war on them immediately? Baubles anyway. Real men trade blows, if only in the prac. We're gonna need to deal with the revolt up there first, anyway. Commander, you may as well get comfy, men. Actually, yeah, they're gonna attack. Um, the capital there, they're not gonna go for him, definitely. How may I serve you? Only unseen. At least we can use the assassin there to actually slow him down a little bit. Or that is the idea. But you go get the Seleucids to like us. And you 
go. The Timasalian. We can, we can start taxing this now. My wits and words are yours. They fucking move fast. Wish my armies were that fast on the field. With a generous tribute, who look at all that cash. Both of them as well. I don't know why the game notifies you about pirates across the fucking map. Okay. We're sorry. Give me the trade agreement back and an aggression pact as well. Be like a spear. I don't even need your money. What? That's why I usually play battles manually. Let's move this way. We're gonna lose Consentia, actually. Let me just check. Maybe not. We have enough money. Although that's a big hit, anyway. There. I skip no, I cannot. I seek rest. I'll see them. They'll never see me. Ready for orders. Make haste, men. Soldier. Rubber on the set of them. And a bunch of brick pays. Should just grab a we could bring a base and the rest is gonna be the the axemen or s who does more damage melee p damage hmm, i'm thinking ask axemen yeah, gotta get them to flank the enemies If you can hold on to this. Also, we can use some of these mercenaries after the battles as well. Commander. That's your command. 
Although we are going to be in a deficit after this. Well, I mean, fine with me, right? Let's do the battle manually, though. The question is, is, like, some of the battles, like, happened in, in outside the city. It's really odd. Let's see what happens here. Or outside the settlement. I attack them. Maybe they sell you out. This one's gonna be a big fuck off loss for them, that's for sure. Question is, can my guys get the. Eh, probably not. Or better not. Okay, so these are Hastati. And these are Swordsmen. Okay, we're gonna use the Swordsmen uh, to flank. And the Cav. with the plebs. They're useless. Okay, who has better melee defense? Them, actually. The town guard. Italian spearman. These are more better, uh, better armor, though. So let's use the town guard since we may need to like go after the enemy after the battle. No, oh, no, never mind. These can go into phalanx. Look real nice. Pugman, ready for orders. Understood. Okay, I was hoping that was impassable terrain, but it's not. Let's keep these behind them just in case. One of them at least. Now as for the slingers, let's see. Place two of them there. Actually thinking of using them to flank the enemy. I'll just leave them there just in case. I think the melee guys are gonna be enough for the for the flanking. Plus we got these. Now I'm not sure if we can actually light these up. Plus we can't... Oh my god, we can't place them anywhere. Oh, fuck it. I guess we can block off... Yeah, we can't block off anything actually. We do something like this. Nah, better not. It's gonna do more damage to us than that than to the enemy. 
We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Spears! Spears! The eyes of the Senate and all Rome are upon us today. I expect the AI to be smart and go around. The Roman gods are watching. Make sure they are not ashamed. Look at that. The AI is the dumb as fuck charging and cam into phalanx of all things. Yeah, I should have moved the cav a little bit faster up so we can actually catch the retreating enemies. We're gonna use you there and we're gonna flank with these all the way. And with these. Good if they go back into the fight, that's better. General! Levy Slingers! Levy! Spear infantry, relay! Effort and speed! Ready to ride! Right, no one's attacking these guys at all. Move them in as well. What are the plebs? We go attack that. We're dealing with those. Okay, let's get the commander out here as well. Get over here as well.
Yeah, I think these guys are gonna do more damage to us than them at this point. Where the fuck did you get down there, man? Clips. Wells. Okay, now we need to hunt them all down. We're gonna all come this way around here. She broke. That's something. You know, you'd think they'd break faster at this point. Yeah, let's... Like... Get them around all the corners where their enemies might retreat. Like that. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Fuck 60 might actually break through here. Seems like they are. display indeed then again the A's are like really really high level troops well elite troops more or less
I think they bunched up so much that we actually can't flank them. Funnily enough. These guys only lost 10 men as well. The battle is turning in our favor. So now it's turning in our favor. Zero enemies. Go catch them. Stop these guys from chasing after the slingers, though. It looks like all of them are gonna break. There we go. Now to wipe the Carthaginians off the map. Can you stop firing? Since the AI also needs population, I don't think they're going to be sending any elite armies at us in a while. Yeah, that's enough. I'm surprised these guys actually broke. And again, they were up against the most elite Carthaginian units as of yet. the fuck away. Oh, never mind. There's another army.
money situation is going to be shit though. Three armies, a navy, and some mercenaries as well. Recruited. My question is, do I... I think I'm going to need to like attack Syracuse first. Because you never know when they're going to like backstab me. They are the allies in, after all. development and do they do have a full stack there as well How may I serve you? it's not going to happen We're still making money a little bit. I don't want to keep that army there. We cannot do that. The seven turns until fully replenished. Or three. Waiting for orders. Okay, we do know we, they can't make it over here in one turn, so let's patrol here. What do you wish of me? Or now. We hunger for battle. Garrison Auxilia. Public morale. Or public order. Ready for orders. For empire maintenance, upkeep for all units. That's gonna help with the mercenaries. I don't want to keep them there for until I get my guys down there. Commander. I mean, this is a decent army as is. A lot of front line is lacking a little bit. So the, I might just leave these up there. I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to leave this army up here. Or just in case. I get betrayed by the, by the 